Susie and Lee Dongwook's breakup was announced, there has been a big reaction from netizens around the world. Breaking, Lee Dongwook and Susie have broken up. K-netizens have mainly been understanding of the situation with some pointing out their big age gap as a big obstacle. It happens. They really didn't look that great together anyway. Young people who are unmarried date and then break up, that's what they do. It's not just these two, but it's the same for any other celebrity too. Isn't it completely normal for unmarried men and women to date and then break up? Their age gap is so huge, it was the right choice to break up now. You can't just ignore the generation gap. Meanwhile, international netizens have not been as sympathetic towards Susie, with many slut shaming her. Ad choice is advertising in red invented by Teed. They have even gone as far as to call Susie the Taylor Swift of Korea. Some international netizens have also been mocking Susie for dating men with the last name, Lee. In fact, Susie has only openly dated two men, both of whom just happen to have the last name, Lee, which is not at all surprising as it is the second most common surname in South Korea after Kim. According to a 2015 South Korean census, the number of Korean citizens with the last name, Lee, accounted for 14.7% of the population, 7,306,828 people. Source, Statistics Korea, despite the absurdity of the mockery, numerous netizens have continued to, like, the comments ridiculing Susie and her choice in men. Mind you, there were also international netizens who defended Susie and showed sympathy as well. Despite some of these hurtful comments blaming and mocking Susie for the recent breakup, fans hope that Susie will be able to overcome this difficult time and focus her efforts on acting. Susie has a full plate on her hands as she will be starring in the upcoming drama Vagabond, which is scheduled to begin airing later this year. New boy group created by producer of Girls Day set to debut in August.